box there. They've got plenty to chew on at the moment, but no bite. Looks to slip it through. Here it comes. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. Played out to the right. He's made sure that that won't get through. Out to the left it goes. Tries a through ball. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Hesse knocks it in gently. Now it's Alcacer. Alcacer with a delicate ball. Yes! Could that be the start of something big? The goal given such an open invitation he was always going to shoot it's really a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box nobody sensed where the danger was lurking and the finish was made a lot easier Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Listen, the pressure and intensity of a final can give the scores of that first goal a huge, huge lift. The others, well, they'll get to feel a sense of panic now. Company. They've scored near to half-time to make it 1-0. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. I thought it was good vision, but the execution was poor. Juan Iturbe doing well down the right, but he's left himself in need of support. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. And it's Navas. Just needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Now the pass. It's the through ball. Surely it's anyone's ball. Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. It's good progress he's made on the ball. Tries lifting it over. Aga plays it out to the flank. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. We had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? Yeah, they'll be boosted by the fact that they've got the advantage at this stage, but will their approach be the same after the break? Um, certainly, if they don't add to it early on in the second half, I think they may begin to retreat, just try and hold on to what they've got. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Looks like a good ball through. That intervention was very necessary. Looking to shoot! That's a half-decent try. But if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. Plays it out to the wing. Passes it through. Hesse. So 
There's still just a goal between them. Juan Iturbe. He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Tries a through ball. Played out wide. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. A goal kick. <laughs> Tries to stroke it through, and he's cut it out. Well, the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Now it's Jesus Navas. Wide to the right. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Now the pass. Stroop. Very well to intervene. Navas. It's come loose. Hagger pushes it out wide. Made certain that won't get through. Deftly done. Throws it out of harm's way. Fernando and it's Sterling looks like a good ball through goes for the cross Sterling plays it out to the flank Alcacer has created one goal already pumps it upfield oh surely goes for goal this could fall anywhere tries one and the writing was on the wall. It looked like this was going to happen, and it has. The goal scorer. After 75 minutes, is number two. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, without doubt, that's given the coach food for thought. Does he settle for extra time or try to go for a winner before then? Decision time. Played out to the right. Sterling. It's a loose ball. Looks to slip it through. Out wide to the right. Now here's the through ball. Into a bay. Drilled in low. Fernando gets good distance on it. The last moments of the cup final, and we still don't know. This is gripping. Looking to get within range. And copy of his previous miss. Well, I wonder if their profligacy will rebound on them somehow. You know, they're very much on the up here, and yet they can't convert a string of very decent opportunities. And it's 
it's been taken short. Can he score? Trying. The outcome could so easily have been different. Sterling. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. It's all very neat football, but time is against them now, and they need to get the ball forward. And it's Aguero. Aga is the route one option. Out to the left it goes. Now it's Alcacer. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Forward at pace. Alcacer is going to run down the left wing. And this is Hesse. Hesse! Another chance! Oh, he's won it! And just as we were headed for extra time in Milan, that surely settles it. Look, sometimes you're happy to go to extra time, but more often than not, you're happier to avoid it. And to reclaim the lead couldn't have been timed much better than that. And I think we'll all be stunned if that doesn't see them go on and, and clinch this. Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. And that is that. The date in their history, the pinnacle of their existence, the greatest honour European football has to bestow, winners of the Champions League. So on to centre stage come the central characters, the individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment.